The title of today's presentation is Transaction Rate Comparison of Combination versus Video Microscopic Rate Bisecting Method. Hello, I'm Dayon Kim from South Korea. Limo introduced the microscope to the hair transplantation field in 1988, and it's been widely used for graft dissecting. Rose and Shapiro published on the combination method of optic binocular microscope slippering and lupus for graft cutting with its benefits and advantages in 2004. In 2004, Sharon Kenny introduced and discussed about the benefits of ergonomic, quality assurance and easy teaching of the video microscope to the hair transplantation field. Since 2009, our clinic has performed over 400 hair transplant cases with their video microscope. Our system is composed of 60 load handheld digital microscope with 19 cells to monitor. Combination method of slivering and graft cutting is needed for maximizing graft productivity. Our intention is to compare the transaction and speed rates of graft dissecting using two different graft preparation methods. One is the use of video microscope alone for slivering and graft cutting versus a combination method of slivering on the 20 power video microscope and graft cutting on the 2.5 power lupa magnification. 12.5 cm length strips were collected for both methods from patients' original ellipse of the mid hospital portion. The width of strips were from 0.7 cm to 1.4 cm. Two methods were performed by the same two technicians of our clinic. We recorded the procedures on Sony High Definition video camera. We performed hair transplants on six patients. All patients were ethnic Koreans with black colored hair. We made separate video clips for each patient. Two reviewers checked on the recorded clips to measure the transaction rate, slivering time, and graph cutting time. One lacking feature of a video microscope is its less 3D effect. It took about three months for our technicians to get used to it. Slivering is less influenced by low 3D effect since graph cutting requires 3D teardrop shaped cutting of hair follicles. Some surgeons underestimate the importance of magnification for that Asian hair has a high caliber, more contrast to skin color, and low density. Some sorts of magnification must be employed mandatory until the last step of graph dissecting procedures. After slivering on the 20 power video microscope, the technicians perform graph cutting with two different methods. Half of slivers with a video microscope, while the other half with lupus. Video microscope technicians sit straight and look forward. However, for its lack of 3D fact, overall operating time was longer than a combination method. Video microscope with left 3D effect could get over, while speedway couldn't reach up to any big combination method. Transaction rate of a video microscope graph cutting was competitive to a combination method. However, the speedway was cut nearly by an half. A video clip of 2.5 power loop by magnification view is seen. This canon macro lens was specially used for the presentation. With loop by magnification, since it's free from less for the effect of a video microscope, it's like a graph detecting through our own eyes with more power of magnification. No solid difference was observed for the graft cutting spears. Both long deterrent dissection and teardrop 3D shape were faster with loop back magnification. The speed rate of graft cutting was about double fold greater with loop back magnification. 
the transaction rates of two methods were nearly the same. Table 1 is shown the data of the graph productivity, transaction rate, and speed rate of a video microscopic graph dissecting. Speed rate was average 350 rest per hour and the transaction rate was 2.2%. Table 2 is showing the data of the same result for the combination graph dissecting method. The graph production rate was 590 graph per hour and the transaction rate was 1.6%. Transaction rates of two methods showed very close results. The total graph productivity was nearly two times greater with the combination method. For maximizing graph production, a combination method is more efficient. Thank you very much for your attention.